Just south of Sacramento, you'll find Lodi Wine Country, a region that's been growing grapes for over 150 years, and unlike most, actually prospered during Prohibition. The way we were able to prosper during Prohibition was our vintners were very innovative in finding ways to ship fruit via rail car to all over the country. And included in the boxes, they would put information on how not to make wine. Go-getters from the get-go, some of the most famous names in wine got their start here in the Central Valley. A lot of the families that you associate with wine actually came to this region as farming families. In the Mondavi's case, they came here to do fruit packing. Major players like the Mondavis and the Gallows helped revolutionize the rural region, from ag land to the world of wine. Today, it's the 70-plus mom and pops like Ryan Sherman and Mike Scott who are the heart and soul of the San Joaquin. The wine with a face, you know, we hear people talking about is it's fun for us, it's family, it's very much a labor of love. Nobody's quit their day jobs. We want to showcase what's possible in Lodi. Sorelli is sisters in Italian. I have two daughters. My wife happens to be Italian. The climate in Italy is very similar to the climate in the Central Valley. Its Mediterranean climate contributes to Lodi's 100,000 acres of premium wine grapes. That's more than Napa, Sonoma, and Lake County combined. The thing about our climate that makes the grapes thrive is the fact that we have varying degree days. Pioneers with a sense of place, they stay true to the roots by making sure you can't escape the grape. Everything from our bus line is called the grape line. Police officers have that on their badge. The city crest has grapes in it. The Lodi flames after the flame grape. Did your daughters have that when they went to school? Were they like the Merlots or something? My daughter went to Toke High. <laughs> Home to a gold rush of grapes, but one variety will remain a little riper than the rest. Zinfandel is what we're known for. We are the Zin capital of the world and we produce about 40% of the state's Zinfandel here. But you have vineyards here that have been in existence for 100, 110, 120 plus years old. If so these vines could talk. They could tell you a lot of history that's taken place here in this region and in the world. We're very, very proud to share with you what we're making and what we're growing. With 100 different grape varieties, the Lodi wine region produces everything from A to Z, from Albarino to Zinfandel.